What it do, baby booze? I am running so, so late. So, I'm running on brown time. So, I thought, what better time than now to make a video? Um, I don't really know what to do with my hair. See, my hair, the thing is, it's curly. But it goes out of control. I wanted to kind of wear a hat. Feeling like a certain style, but, hmm. It was good. You like my hat? I know certain, some of you will really like it. Um, so I just thought I'd make a quick video because I had an interesting experience happen to me yesterday and I ended up talking about it with a bunch of people. And just super quick, um, have you ever texted the wrong person? And I don't mean in the sense like, oh, la di da, I texted this John, something related only to this John and this other John got it. No, I'm talking one in that scenario, but something way more, how do I say, personal or intense or even texting the same person a message, a screenshot of what you wanted to send another person of their message. Basically here are my two scenarios. So I was messaging this, um, I made a group chat, uh, I made a group chat between my friend, let's call him Jack, and his girlfriend, let's call her Dana. So I made this group chat, whatever, and we had said that we were going to blaze together or whatever. And... In the group chat, I was like, hey guys, um, yeah, let me know when you want to blaze or when you just want to hang out and chill, whatever. Just holla at me, send me a text. And as I'm messaging this group chat, what did I call him? Jack texts me in a separate message. And Jack's like, hey, um, I think you put the wrong Jack in the group message. And I'm like, what? What Jack could I have put in, you know? Like, how many Jacks do I really know? And I checked, and it was this Jack that's, like, the head of my school. UCSD, I'm talking about. Like, the head of college. Like, this dude is right up here. And I had his number. Like, you have the dean, and then you have this dude. And I messaged him that, and I was like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. And he was like, hey, are you back in SD? And I'm like, oh, no, not yet. Oopsie. I am so sorry. My bad. Anyway, I'm bringing this up because yesterday I did the same exact thing. I messaged Jack and was like, hey, yeah, let me know when you're here um, if you want to swing by my house. And I literally sent him my address. And then Jack messaged in the new group chat I had made. And uh, he told me that he never got an address. And I realized I messaged the head of my school, Jack. So I completely changed his name on my phone contact. Not Jack, but the head of the school, Jack. And then in this other case, I was messaging this one girl. And we were having a little altercation. See, it takes a lot for me to be angry. I don't get mad. I really do not get mad. I get sad. I don't get mad. So to put me at a level that I'm mad, that's something else. And when I'm mad, I get lightheaded because I just, I don't know what to do. And uh, I was messaging her, whatever, and then I decided to take screenshots, send it to my best friend, who is way more rational than I am. I'm just, my emotions sometimes go, brrrr, and I'm like, oh, okay, let's do it. Let's go. You're talking like this? All righty, huh? Um, no, I'm not like that. But so I take like nine screenshots, and then I message my best friend. I'm like, look at this shit. At least I thought I messaged my best friend. I ended up sending the screenshots right back to her. So she got screenshots of the conversation we were currently having. Then with the text under saying, look at this shit. And when I realized that, I was like, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. What do I say? So I responded to her by saying, I just wanted you to remember everything you said to me because of how I just wanted you to remember the stuff you said because of how stupid it was or not even stupid. That's so mean. I was, I don't know. I was, she was being really mean. I was like, I just want you to remember what you said. 
and she responded by saying, huh? I think she knew, but I thought that was a pretty good response. I was freaking out. I literally sent the screenshots of a conversation back to that person. So other people have definitely done this. Please tell me if you have. You have, and I don't really have that many subscribers. But if you're having to watch this video and watched for this long, write down in the comments section about your personal experience with texting the wrong people. And dude, this has happened to me quite a bit. So much that now I definitely, I second look a hundred times. I like second check to make sure that I'm not messaging the wrong person. What's funny is that the day before I was discussing this and then, and then I did it again. But yeah, that is the quick story. Um, I know other people that have done this. I know other people that have accidentally messaged their parents what they were supposed to message their significant others. And oh God, like, oh, when are you coming over? And the parents were like, what? And this was in high school. So nobody was supposed to come over then. Anyway. I'm going to head to school to do some education after I pick up my friend. Cheers. I'm dead. Like, I am tired. Okay. Um, this is Cherry, my baby. I will tell you the story of Cherry later and how much this car has saved so many people's lives. So many people. Okay. Hope you enjoyed that story of me messing up. And can't wait to read about yours. Bye.